Welcome back guys to Grandia, where last episode, after talking to more villagers in Cafu, we moved forward into the prior site where they lived inside the now petrified forest, meeting Rap's smooth stone parents as we surveyed the destruction. With Justin on board with Rap's desire to destroy the Tower of Doom, they set out to cross the solid woodland, with Rap starting to train up his spell levels on the way. And for statistical purposes, I really do need to do his swords a bit. Hello. Cookies! Swords A HP to 1 for N. Yummy! C is for cookies. Good enough for me. That's a lot of antidotes. You don't need that much. Discard, discard, discard. Here we are. Just, this is it. The tower's on the other side of this. Let's go, Justin. Okay, everyone ready? We'll destroy that cursed tower with our own hands. <laughs> hey, just over there. Cross over to here. No, I want to check out what's over here. No, 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 no. Okay, we'll cross over. Oh, wow, it's not petrified over there. Let's see the Tower of Doom. Look, that's the tower of the guys who turned the forest to stone. That. That's a military building. Is it? They build all their military buildings like that? Are we actually moving straight on? To the Tower of Doom from here. Right, if I spawn, where am I? Okay, cool. I haven't been this route. I've got to check if there's a treasure or not first. Before we move on to the Tower of Doom. I cannot do it just yet. There is an order for this. My level 2 magic's nearly out. Hear the earth roar! <laughs> Hands, are we, are we the baddies? We're in the military base, the Tower of Doom, yeah. No, no, it's fine. It's definitely all above board. 100%. Not a problem. Oh, wind twist like a tornado. I'm using a lot of hail slashes because since last session I thought we've used a lot of fire. We should probably work on some wind levels too. <laughs> Pretty easy. Oh, it's not like she gets that much experience. Right, so yeah, we missed a treasure. Because it's probably on the route. Yeah, there it is. The loop round that I didn't follow through because I thought we're probably really near the goal. That's exactly what this place was. Right, let's go to the Tower of Doom. I was about to say, is there a normal leaving spot? There we go. Fire Cafe Village. <laughs> Look, I've got a I gotta heal. I've got no magic in SP. Got Alright, let me save, let me heal. Let me be good. Alright, let's check the stash, because of course Beckles was like, Check your stash! Which means she means she knows there's something in there. So what am I looking at? Bam fruits. Bananas, yeah, that's bananas. I got some blue pills just in case. Mace book. Sue's mace experience points. Plus one third? What? That doesn't make any sense to me. Plus one third? Sword book. Gadwin's sword experience. Sue's bow experience. Gadwin's fire magic experience. Gadwin's earth magic experience. Sue's earth magic experience. So everyone's got experience. That so all the grinding I did counts for something. I mean, I, I kind of need to stash some items. Uh, 
Uh, I don't need to carry the rain staff anymore, at the very least. I mean, I've got spells for antidotes all over the place now. I've got a better knife on me. Uh, I probably should use that, just to get the space free. Keep the shark and get rid of the helmet. Don't need cookies or antidotes, as we've already said. We'll use this on... I guess I'll use it on you. Right, so we got experience. Maybe one third of what's learned. See, plus one third is a bit of a weird way to put it, though, isn't it? Right, well, there's only one person who can use, like, mace experience for stars. But if I give the that to Rap, then? So we can boost Ramp up with that. So use water magic experience points. Maybe I give it all to Rap. Would level him up good. Seuss fire magic experience ain't gonna be that much. Um, we're just gonna give you all the stuff, mister. You have fire, have earth. I guess you get the bow one too. Gabwin's sword. Yeah, you can have Gabwin's sword experience. It's not that much. Justin gets Seuss mace experience then. And water magic. Should we just save that for him for the future when he gets water? Anything else? Okay, let's see how much this actually does. So for Rap, he's at 851. And his weapon levels are 12, 9, 23. Level up plus 6, strength up goes up a ton. Okay then, um, that's nice. Level up two or three for Rap, two for Justin. Uh, we'll do it for Rap. So he's just gained even more strength and wit. Only one fire level? Why would you get two when you get one? I guess it's really not that much. I mean, Rap needs it more. Any more spells? Burn flare was learned. Gabwin's fire magic is one up as well. It's not really that much we've been carried on, but fireball was learned. Earth magic points is only one level as well. I guess there was a point to actually use Gabwin spells then. Right, wind is at least Sue had a lot of wind to give out, so we'll give that to Rep. That all was learned. More earth. <laughs> Literally zero to anyone. Sure, have zero. <laughs> okay, and then we'll use the maces on you. That's three mace levels. That's actually not bad. I love that. That gets us around a little bit. So now we'll look at our skill levels. So the the spirit of Sue. Etc. and Gavin, <laughs> etc. Gavin's etc. That's what we call them now. Has been passed on to an extent. His strength's a lot higher due to this, which isn't too bad. It's higher than Fina's now. He's at level 29 bows. 12 for daggers, 12 for swords. He got fireball because he got his swords up. What's his next skill? Quite a bit higher than what we've already got, to be fair. With that extra wit, he's even faster, so he's caught up a little bit there. Spell-wise, he learnt Burn Flare. Can he even cast one of them? I don't know how much MP he's got now. We'll have to check that out. He's got Zap All from the Wind and Fire, so that will cost a lot of MP. That might be a way to get him to level some stuff. And his Earth is just nowhere, so we really need to level his Earth so he's got Tremor at the very least. Oh wait, does he not learn Tremor? Well, at least he's level 10 on things, I guess. Right, Justin is now level 20 Mace, so he only needs five more Mace levels to go up. And that will... that will give us a new skill. So what's his MP at now? Level 1 MP is 32, level 2 MP is 22, and level 3 MP is 13. He's actually looking a lot healthier to play with now. 
That's not bad. So I guess I let to look in the stash. I like how the game doesn't tell you that that's there, though. What's with that? Uh, we'll check one day. No, I won't, because the stash is full of stuff. It's literally full of crap. <laughs> well, I should sail, but I never end the game anywhere in proximity of a shop as we head over to the Tower of Doom. Uh, hold on, Jess. Something's wrong. Something's wrong. Now you mention it, I don't see any soldiers. Something's fishy. Look over there. Something's burning. Someone's been here. It's just a feeling, but there's a Lanian behind this, and probably alone. What? Alone? Against the Garlisle forces? What are these Lanians anyway? Hey, Justin, you're a kid and you beat up the Garlisle forces. Hey, when a Lanian loses it, well, you don't want to be there. Hey, <laughs> looks like we're going to get to see a real monster. You ready, Jess? Let's go. Okay, so the military, yet again, has built a base and then got their... Yeah, they've been beating the crap out of the ever-loving crap out of, which is hilarious. How do I get around there from the other side? I kind of feel sorry for this military. I mean, honestly, what's its use? Like, someone beat up the tanks! Anyone else feel sorry about this military? Let's go in the army warehouse. There's a recover point here. Is there a boss here? There's missiles here, most likely. So we can come back here and recover whenever we need to, but it's not like there's any enemies around. Poor military. We have built our latest invention! It is a tank, impervious of attack from the ground! One lenient later? Oh my goodness, what the hell's happened? What is an RSQ set? It stores 120 HP to entire body. Sounds pretty good, actually. Let's give it to the guy who doesn't actually have any heals. A real monster! Just over there! What? She's big and she's what, burly. What is that? Ah, she's here. That husky woman of lane. Don't toy with me. I'll beat y'all to a pulp. Hey, there's something weird about her eyes. Hmm, she's really gone off the deep end this time. We're not gonna get off easy. Huh? You're from Cafu. And you two. So y'all with them. Huh? What's it to you? Who are you talking to? Don't go pulling my chain. I'll pound your butt. Oh! <laughs> Take this! <laughs> oh. Hey! Oh. Raph! It's Becca! Uh-oh. We're in trouble now. She's looking at us. My, my. You didn't run away. Well, I wouldn't let y'all get away. You're gonna be sorry. No, we're gonna win battle with her. When I say she's Becca, I've, Becca's legit done that. <laughs> it's like that <laughs> multiple times. I wonder where she learns this stuff from, right? Well, we're gonna fight Milda. What a great name. Right, um... Well, it looks like this person's big and bad and will probably try to beat me up. So let's use some diggings. And maybe go with the Gadwin strap. You know what I mean? Nope. Drop kick. I'm going to critical there, actually. <laughs> with a twirl, but that didn't stop anything. Nothing has been stopped. And now we're both next to each other. Ow. Critical did not work this time. Can we all separate, please, and not stand next to each other? That'd be great. Let's just cast two diggings. We're going to cast to be able to, like, take anything please she throws at us. us. 
in the meantime. But I was gonna like slow her down. The Gadwin strat is what I'd call that. Even with like all the extra diggings, she still hits like hard. I'm trying to literally make your damage mean nothing and then beat you up because you've got tons of HP. But you're still actually putting out a good amount of hurt, which is the bizarre thing. She's got a big axe. Okay, so. Let's cast. Oh, you didn't have it. I did not know you didn't have that ability. That's interesting. Um, I mean, I want to go to work fighting you then. So I'm just going to throw a rando. No, a knife drill. I'm going to get some knife experience off of you, I'm afraid. Only you have it? Oh yeah, only you have freeze. Here goes. Feel the power of ice. Let's see if I can slow it down to like nothing. She's actually immune. She's immune. Watch out. So am I. It's so good. I guess I'll use four cut then, maybe. Now you'll be okay. Is she immune to a specific element then? Like that would be water, wind. Thunderclap! <laughs> Off goes Justin, flying through the air at the greatest speed. Use another four cut. Oh wow, I take loose. She she's defending. She came out of a good strategy. If she's defending, then I'm gonna cast speedy on oh, myself. Good defense. Got some fire level up from the Please protect us! I've never used this before. Too bad it'll only work on her. We're level two, so that's I don't know how much that's actually buffed your speed. Um <laughs> to be fair. So she's immune to that. Let's use Gadzet. And I guess I'll check another knife hill. Just to slow it out while Justin's trying to cast. She's coming! Combo her first! Great success! That was way more successful than I thought it would be when she started coming into me! Zap, crackle, and pop. Too bad we don't have the last one. Justin got full on cancelled. Only taking six damage though. More knife hills. More knife skill. This is the perfect time to grind weapon skill, I feel. Meanwhile, Justin's the spell caster. Makes sense. Then use some spells I actually haven't used. Here goes! Here goes! Right, use. Don't have enough for that. This is that. Burn to a crisp! 
It's high damage, high MP. This isn't Dragon Z! Dad Zap, and then Dragon Zap. Well, we got 104 weapon skill with Feeder from that one fight. Of course, Rap was not in the fight, so he couldn't even get anything for all of this. Good job, Rap. I missed all of the experiences Feeder levels up. You're, you're tough as nails. What's your name, boy? I'm Justin, the famous adventurer who's never been here before, so therefore my fame can't spread. But, you know, gotta act like you want to be, right? <laughs> Just... Justin, is it? I'm Milda from Lane. Ugh, it's just as old darling said. We must destroy the Tower of Doom. J Justin, didn't she just say that we have to destroy the Tower of Doom? Oh, she did, didn't she? Anyway, let's move her. So she wanted to destroy the Tower just like us. I guess she's on our side then. Uh, uh, ouch. Ow, 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 ow. Are you awake, rat? UK, it sounded totally heinous, man. Yeah, he got himself pounded. You kidding me? It'll take more than that to. Hey, is that what I think it is? Let me at her. Stop it, Rap. It may be that she had the same reason for coming here as we did. She was just mumbling about destroying the Tower of Doom. Yeah, right, I'm away. Unless you want to get hurt too. Rap, cut it out. If you want to fight, then fight me. Just, you don't. Uh, oh. You're saying your name was Justin. How come you all didn't finish me off? I told you, remember? We're adventurers, not soldiers. We've come to wreck this tower. Wreck it? Then y'all got nothing to do with the folks here. Well, my name is Milda, and I'm here for the same reason as you folks. But then they found me. Brilliant deduction. Of course they found you. You draw too much attention. Y'all talking to me, boy? <laughs> yeah, you got a problem. Stop it, both of you. Finding each other is so pointless. Come on, let's work together. The more of us, the less the danger, and the easier it is to investigate, right? But, well, y'all got a point. I also got to apologize about thinking you was in cahoots. Well, we sure aren't in cahoots with no Lanian. Rap. What? What's your problem, eh? As I was saying, it was all my mistakes. So here, Kafu boy, take your best shot. Nah, no thanks. Besides, I forgot about it already. Why, Rap? Hey, Jess, we better get the lead out. No, oh, lead out, even. Come on. Right on. Okay, everyone, let's trash that tower. That lead out thing is used so often in gaming, and I've never blimmin' seen it used in real life. It always catches me every time. Actually, don't recover until you use heals of your own to get more experience, right? In the meantime, Milda is level 35. Has Milda Kick, which requires an axe, so I'm not quite sure what she thinks is a leg. She has Splitter and she has Milda Hit, which uses multiple different types of weapons, of which she has a crazy amount of weapon skill with. She has zero magic. Zero. And zero MP level. At all. Okay then. Zero magic, zero level. I guess we can deal with that. Right, healer, I think, gives the most experience, so we'll use that. And then recover. So it wasn't long on this new continent after leaving behind Gadwin and Sue that we just, just got more friends. No time at all. I like how this is the Doom warehouse. Wreck Axe, do you have? 35 attack, boom. It's part of like the ability as a spell. A gift from Darlin is the bandana. Titan ring plus five attacks. A curious design. 15 move. Worn all the time. Beach sandals. A bikini. Plus four attack. Sexy. Sexy attack. Sure. Did I get anything from her? I don't even know. It's funny, whenever I, like, experience some form of media that my wife has watched or played, <laughs> things start to make more sense all the time. It's so weird. 
Maybe everyone should be doing this for maps. Oh, look at this gold bunny. Hang on that with her. Just things start to make even more sense. I'll have to bring this up with her. Alright, so how do I get all there? I can just climb over here. Get a run seed. That's extra movement, isn't it? I'm pretty sure, anyway. Oh, what agility? You have no way to get extra agility, I'm pretty sure, Justin. So I guess you'll have that. But usually, it's always better not to not cover a weakness. But to amplify a strength of items like that, but whatever. Is there anything here? Is there any way to into one of these other buildings? Seemingly not. That might be the way to go though. This is another warehouse by look things. Chest and inside it, some trust. Hope Milner has tons of SP. Oh, another save point straight away. Hint, hint. I'll change that save point for this one then. Maybe it's just the first floor and we've got a lot of traveling to go. So these are locked. We can get to the second floor pretty easy. But it's locked! Can she just break through them? Can she punch through them? Huh. Well, you know these guys I felt sorry about? I guess it's... Uh, Unfortunate for them that we're here. Nil to kick, no range drop kick attack on one enemy. One enemy, all enemy is splitter. I guess we'll just send you in to beat someone up. No critical one of these guys, thank you. At least she's not as big as Gadwin. I say that nicely. Because it means she can actually get round our enemies. Or our allies. That room is so big. You can get through anyone. Oh, right. So with rap, we begin the earth grind. To start getting him a spell he can actually use to level with. And we'll just send Milder in to beat the crap out of these guys. Beat Leah's. Fino's look baboon! Milder just eliminated one poor guy in the blink of an eye. What a cinch. I'm just sending Justin to deal with the rest. Milder just flattened that bloke. So it's gonna be a bit to get him some earth skills so he can actually get some levels. Let's actually look at some of our moves that we're learning, because I did not know we were in the range for us to get a spell called the boom, for example. So level 16, water will get just in a spell. Four levels extra in wind will also get a spell. And then level 19, earth or water will also. So most of, the, most of it re like relies on earth and water now for Justin. With a little bit of wind. The boom has been learned, which is a level 3 skill. 19 water would get her something. Most of her skills are completely gated by water now. So I just need to be maybe using bubble with her and other things with everyone else. And apart from that, level 5 to you learn probably boom. Which will be handy. I think that will help you grind that up a little bit more. 6 for a solo spell. Everything seems to be earth with you. I mean, there is something for level 12 win, which is probably hell slash. Everything seems to be Earth. Earth's his most important thing, but look at it. So I really need to grind Earth. Can 
you put them to sleep while other guys do other things? Yes, 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 you can. So what am I leveling up with you in the meantime? I guess I'll go over second snooze. Take that! I only hit two that time. Because we need rat. We really need him to start getting stuff. Use your guts! Guts! Mean bubble? Yes, I mean bubble. That's the correct spell name. Can't tell me any different. I'd like to use your moves, but I'm just like, just let's just kill the one that's awake. Was she just dick hitting him repeatedly? She's definitely going for low blows. Grinding you for water so you can get loads of skills. In the meantime, Justin, you just need to do stuff. Let's go with a four cut on the guy on the back. Wow, Milda can only move once. No one else is going to move. So this really like begs a question as to how we're going to get these spells going. I should have grinded Earth with Gadwin. Little did I know. Oh god, it was Sue. I didn't know! Here goes! In fact, it seems all of our guys always target the crotch. The knives were all in his hip! Oh well. Hazards of a blind let's play? Well, yeah, indeed. I mean, I guess in that sense, it's amazing that Becca kept that quiet. <laughs> did Milda just punch this wall? Yes, I think she just did. Got you. Somehow I got a back attack on them. We just won't question it, really. I don't know if I should go with the same strategy or not. Take that! I want to build up water levels with these two, but then we're just not really killing things. And once we're down to two enemies, it's not any good anyway. To be using snooze. She can't reach him. She's doing the power up run around in a circle thing again. Oh, oh wow, she just waited to like the exact time I needed to do that. Use your guts! Guts! So we'll have Milder on attack. Fina on snooze. Justin can do some stuff too. I mean he may as well four cut a guy after all. Did she only attack once or did she just miss the second attack? I think she'll cast snooze before Justin gets his spell off, right? It's good water experience. I feel I slowed down the pace of battle quite severely. Let's keep trying to build up more mace skill. Heavy blow to Milda. Still actually hit for an insanely large amount, all considering. Here goes. There's two right, diggings on Milda and all. Still did quite a lot of damage to her. <sighs> the water grind, right? Uh, 
There's a little bit of war experience to be got for the little bit of damage that's been happening to Milda and Rap. That's not too bad. Obviously, Justin would get more spells, like, with SP if he was using something like that that could hit multiple guys, he'd get a lot more weapon skill, which would be nice. Oh no, if I use that, they'll die. Then Rap can't start using his Earth stuff. Because everyone's dead. Oh no! Kept one alive, you're so kind. Come Milda. Milda, you're so Nuts. slow! You're actually impressed with the girl Oil Force's building speed? How long was it ago that they got over the wall? Well, they've got technology for it. They know how to do the job by the look of it. Here goes! Milda did not get a single turn. Milda did not get a turn. Unreal. She couldn't do anything the entire battle. Well, I don't know which way I'm heading, but it looks like I'm heading in here because reasons. Looks like I missed the end of that corridor because I came through here. I found the correct way before going the full wrong way. How much does heal get as war experience now, by the way? Like, one? I still get three. Right, is that a treasure chest at the end? No, it's actually a locked door. Now we have seen his eyes open. I feel like the Guyalaya forces are just playing like a RTS and they've, they've got short building times. But we're playing a game with heroes characters in it. So we're just walking through them in a horrible monster mash. That makes sense. Rolled someone in an instant. Here goes. Well, no earth experience for Rep. <laughs> Pretty easy. And no water experience for Fina. That's probably the worst order of turns that we want to actually happen. Oh well. It'll happen. When we specifically want to get certain people using certain things. It's a bit of a shame, isn't it? This time around we should get to use them though. If only you had Tremor. Get oh, actually, I don't know if with Tremor he could get Earth experience faster. Hmm, that's a good point. Use your guts! Guts! Don't worry, we're getting rap going. One more earth level. Maybe he'll learn a spell soon. If it's boom after he, he can help us with the attack, which would be pretty good. But it's the feet of water grind that's now the most painful thing. Cast digging really fast. You're at level two now. Go and do it. All right, we won. Oh well. Ultimate drink and a miracle. Seems pretty good. 
What's this earth level now? Three, isn't it? Four. So next level he'll learn possibly boom. Level six isn't tremor because it's not a level two spell. So next two earth levels he will learn full skills. Can I check out that room or not? Probably not. Thing is, I didn't realize that Justin and, and Justin and Fina were actually near learning other s skills, so it's gonna work down that sense. You're not supposed. Well, you it's nice that you're getting some Earth level, but that's not the plan. Use your guts. Guts. I don't think there is any better spell than Snooze for War Experience. I don't know how much experience Fiora gives though. It's a good thought actually. How much experience does Fiora give? <laughs> He's actually chasing the active person? That's kind of cool. What the hell? Well, that guy was chasing Milda too? All right, we That's won. really confusing. That's super confusing. <laughs> oh, now, now Rap is only getting four experience per person we dig in, so 16 total. That's a bit of a shame. That means it's going to take quite a bit longer for him to level up. Do you only get war experience if it actually works on the enemy? I'm pretty sure only if it actually works. So this is still a percentage chance as well. Use your guts! Guts! Essentially, when I've used fire on something fire immune or done zero damage, I haven't got anything. So that's where the assumption comes from. There actually has to be a hit. If it does one damage, you still get full experience. If it does zero or doesn't work, nothing happens. You gonna kill these guys or what? <laughs> Let me knife fill this one. Wow! <laughs> like everyone got spells off before Milda even got to melee one guy. And then Milda decided not to even attack the second one. All right, we won. Well, that's a ton of ultimate drinks we'd be getting. Rap's not far from leveling up again. Anything in here? Can we sleep in their beds? There's four beds. Technically, there's eight. Now we're, you know when I said I felt sorry for these soldiers earlier and of course then we join in in the whole beating of them up and then on, now on top of that we're entering their bedrooms and stealing all their money. Good guys See here. Power. Definitely the good guys. But then good guys do have the right to anything within any building. Because they are saving the world. So you've got to go make up your money somewhere, haven't you? Right, that'll be a good bunch of experience. Of course, Milda's got her specials as well, which we haven't used guts. yet. But we don't need to because she's so good at just smashing people anyway. Come on, use your Milda kick. Here you go! <laughs> Poor guy. So 
I think Justin's two levels away from Maces, and then we want to kind of go back and get him a new weapon, maybe? Depends. There probably is a weapon to find in here, to be fair. Alright, let's rub up these guys' cash. Anything else to rub up? There's a save point there, so we've got to open up a door down here. Oh, that, that is this door. Well, I didn't find a switch or anything. Be nice to get Fina's SP back after all. He's out of knife hill. So we got Bubble. Everyone will go before Milda goes, even if they're behind her on the list, of course. Yeah. Yeah. Fina has learned Resurrect! So that must be the level 16 one. That's probably incredibly really good to have. I can't remember if we've had anyone actually go down yet. But I like it. I want it. Resurrection spell is godly. Don't have to use an item. I mean, she doesn't have to carry any resurrection potions. Unless we, of course, use the MP. But then we can just carry MP instead. Use your guts. Guts. At least when he hits level 5, we'll just, we'll just turn him over to casting Boom. Oh, I can't remember how much Boom actually costs. Oh, do you know what? I'm going to cast... Fiora. Because it's an attack. Oh, power of ice. It might give us some extra water experience. And it combines with wind, of course. So if it actually works on him, then what we can do now is see how much wind experience All right, we Fiora got from that spell. And then we'll be able to work out the water experience that she gained. Eight. So still, snooze is better, obviously. But on a single target... We'll probably use that because it doesn't cost much level 3, you know, MP. So Resurrect's been learned. Nice. <laughs> Get digging, Rip. I kind of want to let her use her special move. Splitter. Do you think you can snooze before she attacks? Use your guts. I don't know. I don't think guts. so. Let's see what it looks like then. She's getting ready. Yeah. Oh, she got there in time. Nice. I wonder how much war experience resurrection is. I'm going to knock y'all down at once. Ha! Did we just destroy the base? No problem. Woo! I'm gonna knock y'all down of words. That's how you get a weapon experience up then. 100 percentiles. Right, which way am I going? So there was a dead end there. And I get the fact that I probably shouldn't step on the red bit. What happened then? It made a noise. I don't think anyone stepped on it, but maybe someone got, got trailing behind me. Justin's enjoying the grind. He's getting a lot of the earth levels we weren't working on last time after all. Every earth level is more strength, remember? So he's getting more powerful, no matter what. Use your guts! Guts! Bye. <laughs> 
Rapid learn wow! But how much experience does wow give, Rap? So that's another buff, isn't it? And that's a single target buff, which means it's probably not going to give as much experience as digging does. Ah, oh, well, we've got to get at least another level then and find what that gives us. One of these guys is not asleep. She just straight up charges them, doesn't she? I think he's dead. All right, we won. I don't think WoW gets me much experience, so we're gonna have to go for the level 16, especially because it's shared experience with fire. Rat reaches level 22. 